everyone, Jennifer here, back with another edition of TV Talk. It's Sunday, and that means it's Dragon's Day. And this week's episode was Rough Transition. While visiting Wing Maiden Island, a baby razor wing bounds with Roughnut, who suddenly finds herself trying her hand at being a wing maiden. Okay, so, things I liked about this episode. Now, like most of the DreamWorks Dragons episodes, this is, particularly with this season, this is the first one I've actually seen. So, you're really getting my first impressions of it, and this episode really, it didn't do a lot for me. Uh, I'm not saying it was a bad episode. I'm just saying for me personally, um, there wasn't much going on in the fact that I can say I actually liked it. Um, I mean, was the focus on someone dipping this time? Yeah, it was, you know, on the twins, mostly rough nut. Um, which is a little different. Usually you're fo we're focusing on the group or, you know, Astrid or Hiccup. And this one was a little different. Um, and normally when we have something with the twins, the focus is on both of them equally. This one was almost solely on Rough Nut, although Tough Nut does help out with the training a little bit. Um... But it is, the focus is more on her than her brother, um, which is a little different in my, um, from what we normally see with the twins. But, um, <laughs> excuse me, um, <laughs> excuse me again, uh, sorry, allergies, um, That in and of itself is not enough to say whether or not I liked it or I hated it. It's just, it was, it was a great episode. I'm, I'm just going to leave it at that saying it was a great episode. There there wasn't anything I, I got, that got me really excited about the episode, but again, yeah, there was nothing I, it made me want to turn the episode off either. So, yeah, on the flip side, that coin... Uh, things I didn't like about the episode. Again, nothing I didn't like about the episode. Um, I will say I didn't like how, basically, because this razor wing bonded with her, or seemingly bonded with her, um, Rough Nut was automatically assumed that, you know, she had to become a wing maiden. Um, I feel that is something that's more a choice, um, but, you know, maybe, um, but, you know, the authors, the writers decided a little differently, and, you know, it all did, it all did work out in the end, basically, so, you know, I can't get too upset about that, but again, I'm really nothing to say I absolutely hated it, I wanted to turn the episode off, I didn't want to watch it to the end, or I didn't want to fast forward through it to the end, um, so I had that going for it. Okay, quick reminder on my comment rules. Hey, feel free to check out my related DreamWorks Dragons videos.
my other DreamWorks Dragons TV Talk videos. In my other TV talk videos. And my other videos.
Okay, before I sign off, a few things I'd like to touch on. First off, YouTube subscribers, any of my videos that can be found on YouTube are on my Facebook page. Facebook friends, basically the same thing. Any of my videos that cannot be found on Facebook are on my YouTube channel. And to anyone who's interested, you can feel free to check out my group on Facebook, Fanfic Corner. Please leave your comments and questions in the comment section. I do love to read those. Please like and share this video if you're watching. Them. Please feel free to follow me on Wattpad, Tumblr, Instagram, and Twitter. I do have my name for those four sites right there on the screen, as well as the pictures I use for the icons. Please note that all pictures seen within this video do belong to the respected artists. I own absolutely nothing. And the links for the four video four site for the links for any sites I mentioned, excuse me, um, will be in the description section um, if that makes it any easier for you guys. Okay, uh, Dreamworks Dragons will be coming to an end in mid-November, and that means there will be an opening for a new TV Talk series on Sunday. And that means that you guys get to vote and tell me what show you would like me to do a set of videos on. Your choices are Horseland, Outlaw Star, Dot Hack Sign, and Inuyasha. Voting is extremely simple. All you have to do is write a positive comment and or like or love a positive comment on one of the four shows listed and whichever one gets the most votes is the one I'll do a set of videos on. Please keep in mind that negative comments and dislikes do not count as votes and if Inuyasha is selected I will be um, going up through season one of the sequel as of the posting of this video. Also, please keep in mind for those of you watching on YouTube, I do have a poll going on my homepage for this as well, but that is a one-time shot vote. You can't vote more than once on that, unfortunately. That is just how the poll is set up that way. Or that is just how the poll is set up, excuse me. Uh, voting will be until the 13th of December, or November, excuse me. Um, but if I have to change the date, I will let you know. And for those of you voting in the comment section, you may vote as many times as you wish, but please keep in mind, um, no matter how you vote, in the event of a tie or absolutely no votes, I do have the final say. So far, the votes stand at one vote for Horseland and three votes for Inuyasha. However, you do have a little over a month left, so be sure to get your votes in and make your voices known. Okay, please like and share if you're watching this video, if you're watching on Facebook, and like and subscribe if you haven't already, if you're watching on YouTube. Okay, and as always, thank you for watching, and have a very nice day.